Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's W3S7 here, and today we are playing a very, very new game. Um, actually it's not that new, but I've seen some people play this, and I have, uh, been wanting to play it, so. This is, I think it's like a game where you get to, like, choose what happens, like, you get to experience the story, and you just choose how things go, and you make the choices for the, you know, the people. So, if it's not like that, then I have no idea what this is. And, um, anyway, we have the trial here. We're gonna play the whole thing. And if you guys want to see more, all you gotta do is view the video and leave likes on the video. Um, the, if this video gets some views, like quite a bit of views, then I will be buying the whole game and playing it. Anyways, let's go ahead and get right into this. So let's go ahead and start the trial up. Life is strange. It's basically a story-based game featured player choice and consequences while you're in game action. It will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Okay, so. Um, Okay, we just go ahead and start off with something going on here. Okay, what? Who is this? I do get to move. That's, that's kind of cool. Wasn't really expecting that. Um, should we explore a little bit? It doesn't look like we can do anything this way. Um, well, it doesn't look like there's any secrets. I don't really like um, the way the controls is set up. They're a little awkward. But, uh, it's like a pretty fast storm going on. Oh my god! Jesus Christ, there's a freaking tornado. Holy shit! Best be getting in there. I don't think that's gonna save you though. So surreal. They called film little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay. okay. I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light like just had a... to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't and white? fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <gasps> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, this doesn't make I could frame sense. any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that it. to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of their beauty or innocence? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. She had a brilliant eye. So, she could have taken another approach. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Yeah, I don't know if this pauses it. 
but uh, here's this you guys can read. Oh, I'm gonna read it. October, my favorite month, the best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color, turning into tiny flames, but it's still too damn hot. Thanks, global warming, and I can bust out big coats, sweaters, or scary movies yet. Yeah, soon, Kate okay, let me borrow all the October country by the Ray, Ray Bradbury. I haven't read much by him, which caused Warren to almost revoke my geek cred before I held up a copy of Battle Royale, but he knows that an uh, autumn atmosphere of small towns. It's my last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe. I have pictures in one of my old albums. I should find a real Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. Is that or a Vortex Club uh, stroke fest swing party? Or is that backstroke fest? You so punny, Max. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy, as my parents would love telling me on a loop. You have all the time in the world. I got accepted. Okay, we're not reading all that, but... Max, okay, so this is Max. Victoria Kate. A lot of other stuff here. We have not unlocked yet. Okay, so I'm not sure I have so to sure admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer Robert Frank. I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the he 21st century. The but America, I like it old school. And there was honesty about the economic conditions of the air. But a beauty um, in the struggle. I don't think it's you, you don't have beauty without Sophie. a beat. Which explains why my Frank little camera bag is battered but still news. kicking. And both were the great chroniclers uh, of the 1950s. Well, That's pretty retarded. We've all seen I feel like we'd iconic get shot of Kerouac on the balcony. That. And if you haven't, I'm shame, sure. shame. Capturing the romantic. I should take a picture to prove I'm still here. Bowie. Plus, it's yeah. perfect for my portfolio. And now, I have to get my daily selfie quota. With Salvador Dali's surrealist photographs. Like Cocteau, he was a true Renaissance man. Shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture so, has always been a vital aspect of art see. and photography for as long wish as it's been around. My mic would like turn. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Um. Uh. You're asking me. L let me think. Um. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The daguerrean process brought okay, out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. Okay, I don't you know if that's good or not. In your textbook, or okay. even online. Hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart okay, so a career I in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Like Taylor, had it. don't hide. But I want to be louder in my videos, which is what I'm trying to, to do. <sighs> so sorry if that uh, was uncomfortable for you guys. Yes, Victoria. Victoria doesn't. Even her school books are gift wrapped. I can't believe she made fun. I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shot, and I'm sure hmm. you know this might make a cool shot. 
I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Gotham Academy. You have just by participating, by putting yourself out there in the world. Now, no matter who wins, this is just a bump on a bigger road. Hi, Kate. Oh, excluded from hi, Max. Process, but I also want everybody to know that this photographic world is not for everybody. You seem quiet today, just thinking too much. Everybody should have totally. I only want to share whatever gifts I have in the world. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. No worries. Let's hang later. Sure. Okay. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Okay. Paper ball. Now I wish I wouldn't have read this. Purge. Yeah, I understand what it says. Um, just trying to uh, get the most out of this. Is there a way to like walk past here? So. Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. All right, then let's do it. This is ridiculous. I always get so shy and nervous around Mr. Jefferson. She's got the hots for Mr. Jefferson. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Even in pictures, the forest around here always looks mysterious. Hmm, this is some major foreshadowing going on. Camera. Whoa, Mr. Jefferson is not messing around with that monster. He probably paid 20 grand for that camera. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Kim, uh, you didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to pass you always Welcome to the real world. Cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture. Oh my goodness, I don't want like this. I never like this. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Like the drama part. Splash water on my face and so make sure pretty, I don't look like a total gay. loser. Um, I hate that class, it's so fucking boring. Oh yeah, just post against the wall, that makes you look dope. She's so fucking shy. Okay, copyright and music, copyright, 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 copyright. I don't know if that's uh, copyrighted or not. But we, we went ahead and muted, muted that. I don't know if, uh, I don't know. If uh, that's copyrighted or not, um, but we're going to audio settings and we're going to turn the music off. So now, once we've done that, we can put our sound back on. Go back, back, back. Okay. So. Alyssa is always texting, but she doesn't hang out with a lot of people. Evan doesn't say much to me, but his photos are very cool. This is my locker? Why is mine I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous, as usual. Mm. That's Dana talking to... 
I think his name is Justin. Dana is on my floor, too. She's such an archetypal, gorgeous cheerleader. I've seen Brooke hanging out with Warren. She seems like his type. About people just walking down the hall. Oh, wait, we didn't, uh... Stella is always deep in her notes. She didn't come to Blackwell to mess around. I hate bully jockstraps like Logan. And he's a Vortex Club member. Poor Daniel, he's so nice. I wish I could beat the shit out of Logan. Let's just do it. Missing person. It looks like she's been gone for months. See, um... Dragon. Is this high school? Are people 14? They should just call it a sugar machine. That would be awesome if you put money in there and a bag of sugar dropped out. Gun free zone. This is missing person. Missing person thing is pretty important. That's so messed up. I should contact them to find out what I can do. As if I am. Don't need a PC, miss the Poetry Jam tryouts, and I did not steal that backpack. Anyway, we're gonna walk a little faster here. The Bigfoot Stomp. I should develop some school spirit. Go team. Okay, we so we can't leave. Where do we need to go? Miss Grant is a great science teacher. Principal doesn't come out of his office much. What are we doing exactly? God, Samuel is such a weirdo. But I kinda like that about him. Am I stuck? Okay, no. I need to go this way. No. Where am I going? To the bathroom? Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. <sighs> Illuminati! The Illuminati. Now who would bother to write that crap? Oh yeah, we're washing her face. I forgot about that. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Don't do that. You, oh, you just throw it down on the ground. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. What? So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me Holy out if shit. I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines Holy now. Shit. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell Holy everybody God. Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? 
What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? What? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. This is some final he shot uh, that destination girl. shit. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, oh, shit. Can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer I cannot believe who this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller? Diane, can I actually Arvis? reverse time? Go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. Arvis? You feel like totally Whoa, haunted by- this is shit. This shit is crazy. I better rewind. This shit is crazy, dude. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? That's crazy. That is so cool. Anybody? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. Has been I can tell. This is crazy. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point can I save her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. That's Very good, Victoria. Long. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Now, Max, since you've captured our in. Um. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, this is awesome. mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes, Victoria, you still... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. 
Can I just I'd give never you? let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars... I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Alright. Oh, fuck me, dude. I accidentally said the freaking thing again. Excuse me. Let one of photography's. I'm on. Max. Okay, let's get out of here. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Science class with those. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face, I shredded my photo, then the butterfly flew in. Butterfly, and I took fucking a butterfly effect, dude. That's what that symbolized. I didn't even realize that. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wowzer, it's so happening crazy. again. Are people trying to control me. You are I need a hammer to break it open. For this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Holy shit, I can't let this happen. No. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. Okay. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You have completed trial mode of Lost of Strange. Please purchase. Okay, so that's that's it for the um, episode here, guys. That is the completion of the trial, and I'm probably gonna get this because that was a really, really good game so far. Um. So that's pretty cool. We're going to um, get the actual game soon and we'll do a playthrough for you guys if you guys like it. And if not, I'll just play it for myself because it's pretty good. And uh, that's going to do it for the episode, guys. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, please leave a like on this video and I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to comment what you think and I'll see you guys next time.